Alrighty, welcome gentle gamers. This is part two. MTG Greybeard is doing Core Set Mixer 2019, 2020, 2021 of the Magic the Gathering Core Set. Oh, my opponent sucks at magic. That's always good news if I'm trying to get a win. Really hoping I draw a mountain or one of those green uh, cards that helps me fix, but luckily I got one of the three swamps in the deck. And if I draw at least uh, one mountain and another land in the next six turns, I'll get Vivictus Asmati out as fast as possible. I'm actually not sure if I had the Legends version of him or just the Chronicles version, which came out a couple years after Legends, as I recall. I definitely remember the Elder Dragons from those days. Oh, is that the Crimson Tide Bat? Crimson Vow Bat. How cute, a little bat. Let's start off with a swamp. Oh, little bat's getting animated. What do you do? Can I click on you? Ah. How cute. I didn't go with the pre-order bundle, but maybe I'll get the bat from my... Uh, Experience rewards with the mastery pass. You're a batter, a, you have the face of a pig, I feel like. Cute little bat, my pet is jealous. Well, I really do hope I draw a mountain in the next few draws. Next draw will be great. I could get my Scorch Spell Gorger Weird out. Well, here's what I need for the fixin'. I'll be able to cast uh, Vivictus pretty soon. Add X mana of any one color. I'll make it red. If I draw land, I can cast Vivictus on turn five. Oof, I gotta discard. I guess I'll discard. Uncaged Fury? No, I want to use that to double the Victus. Okay, so I'll add a red mana. Do I play the Spell Gorger here? I do. bigger than 40 cards that's wild guess when you're doing a lot of milling that's what you want to do how many cards is that deck zap me huh let's draw a land nope another spell gorger weird Well, or I could cast Uncaged Fury. Or I could cast Shock. I'm thinking I'll play Azusa. I could get really, really get going once I had one of my guys that lets me play lands off the top. Or even better if I draw a land. Ouch, Epicure of Blood. Lotus Feeler, that's a nifty one. Hex Proof. Add three mana of any color, but you gotta sacrifice two lands and it enters tapped. The Black Lotus of 2020. Uh, no blocks. I suppose I could block with both and only lose one. Maybe I do want to do that. Because I don't have a lot of evidence that Zeus is going to help me that much. And I got another Spell Gorge of Weird. I'll let you choose. Who do you want to kill? Interesting choice. I'll add a red. I'll play a couple. 
couple of weirds. So that I can't cast Pride Malcolm. How about a land? I really like to mill, huh? Make a red? Oh, I got the Elder Dragon. Cage of Fury will be a nasty shock. Blood Burglar. Are you gonna burgle me? Add a red. Play a green. Wait, what happened to my red mana? Oh no, it auto used it for. Ugh. Oh, well, that's annoying. Oh no, it. it... Oh, choose permanent creature. Oh, those players sacrifice those permanents, each player. Okay, so I'll sacrifice a forest, and you'll sacrifice the fell specter. Now, Uncaged Fury will be enough to finish you off. If I can just remember to cast it before... I start my attack and lose the mana drained out of my mana pool like a jerk. Thanks for bearing with me. The MTG Greybeard is new to Arena, and uh, although I'm an old hand at Magic, I haven't really been in the game much lately, so uh, i still got a lot to learn, especially about these older sets. So please do leave me comments if you think my draft choices or gameplay choices could use some improvement. Tell me the principle I'm missing. Tell me just what the better play might have been. As I often say to my middle school students, you know, young people have a better imagination. And imagination is useful for doing critical thinking. I wonder if they have a counter spell for my uncaged fury. No, they don't, because they're only they only have the one card. They can rise from the grave. But not cast the fell specter. I'm just gonna say good game. Somebody who invested in that play pack. Oh, they're able to get it back. I can play a shock on that. Shock to deal two damage to the Snapping Drake. We're gonna play Uncaged Fury. And the Evictus is Naughty the Dire. Or 
are going to attack with double striking the Victus. Oh, I should have attacked with the Spell Gorger weird. Library Larcenist. Good game. Well, that was fun. Got to use Vivictus's Maudie, the Elder Dragon. Wouldn't it be fun to make a uh, Elder Dragon Highlander deck with that guy? Or I guess in the arena we've only got the option of doing historic brawl. I'm going to take a little break. Thanks for watching. Return for part three where I'm going to do game two.